Hi. I just thought I'd let you know I got good news. This is EJM from live.egm727.com. And I just got great news. I, a few years back, wanted to start a con IT consulting business for individuals and small businesses that can't afford an IT staff. So I decided to uh, look for a domain name. Turns out I went with EJM Consulting and I wanted to get the .com but somebody already beat me to it a few years back. So as a newbie I didn't realize the importance of .com. So I went with the next best. I went .org. My um, consulting website is ejmconsulting.org. Well, uh, in December, I got word from an outfit that was letting me know that uh, the .com was coming available because the gentleman that had it before uh, decided to let it go. And they wanted me to spend all sorts of money to get my name. And if you're in the same boat as I am, uh, with 2008, um, uh, money was getting tight. So, although I wanted it, I just couldn't see justifying spending the kind of money that they were asking for. Well, uh, towards Christmas, I got another outfit that said that I could have it for about 100 bucks, which was a little bit more reasonable, but again, we're talking Christmas time, and I don't know about you, but having uh, a lot of expenses generally at the end of the year, I had to be careful on my money. Well, a couple days ago, I got another tickler, so I went to uh, whosit.com. That's a great website to determine who owns a website name and whether or not it's available. So I uh, put EJM Consulting in for .com, and suddenly it was available. So I switched over to my hosting company, which is oneonone.com. I find they're very effective for what I utilize. And um, generally, uh, my site's up um, nine times out of 10. It's rare when it's down. And so I uh, put in the domain name, in, and I now own ejmconsulting.org. Uh, dot com excuse me and um, for those that are saying well what why is that important well Google tends to put dot coms in front of all the other sites and you really got to promote uh, in order to get dot org or all any uh, the other uh, alphabet above dot com so I'm sort of happy but it gives me uh, a challenge this year decide whether or not right now I currently have my dot com and dot org going to the same web area with the same uh, information so uh, I have a challenge this year to determine if I want to separate uh, put my commercial uh, aspects which I uh, EJM consulting is for web design uh, database development and uh, helping people learn how to utilize their computers more effectively. Those are the three areas I felt that individuals and small businesses and startups are looking for. So I have to decide whether or not I want to separate .org and make that something else, maybe a nonprofit, something to think about. But anyway, I, uh, one of the reasons why I want do this video is one of the things that was uh, gnawing me at the back of my head is this guy that wanted a hundred bucks for my web and I thought well maybe it was just a scam and that's something to think about when when you get uh, these people sending you these emails about uh, you can get your uh, domain name and I was fortunate because I um, decided to wait I was able to get my domain name for considerably less than a uh, hundred bucks and I want to caution you about that so uh, besides letting the internet world know that I now uh, own the domain name ejmconsulting.com I just wanted to uh, make you aware that there are scams out there that will 
want to uh, take advantage of you and you might not even get the domain name. So I caution you to be real careful. Anyway, this is EJM generally at live.ejm727.com just letting you know again that uh, I was fortunate to get my domain name, uh, my .com domain name, ejmconsulting.com. Anyway, have a good day and I look forward to talking to you. Bye.